M. Sadiq, one of the original litigants of the Ayodhya case who has died and is being represented through his legal heir, had assailed certain findings of the 1994 verdict in the case of M. Ismail Farrakh we holding that a mosque was not integral Supreme Court The Supreme Court is likely to resume hearing on the contentious Babri Masjid Ram Temple and dispute case on Friday. A special bench of Chief Justice Dipak Misra and Justices Ashok Bhushan and S.A. Nazir on May 17 had heard submissions on behalf of Hindu groups that had opposed the plea of their Muslim counterparts that the 1994 verdict holding that a mosque was not integral to the prayers offered by the followers of Islam be referred to a larger bench. Ad choice advertising in red invented by Teed M. Sadiq, one of the original litigants of the Ayodhya case who has died and is being represented through his legal heir, had assailed certain findings of the 1994 verdict in the case of M. Ismail Farrakh we holding that a mosque was not integral to the prayers offered by the followers of Islam. He had told the bench that the observations made in the land acquisition matter pertaining to the Ayodhya site had a bearing on the outcome of the title case. However, the Hindu groups had said the issue relating to the observations that the mosque was not integral to Islam has already been settled and cannot be reopened. The special bench of the Apex Court is seized of a total of 14 appeals filed against the High Court judgment delivered in four civil suits. A three-judge bench of the Allahabad High Court, in a two-to-one majority ruling, had in 2010 ordered that the land be partitioned equally among three parties, the Sunni WAQF board, the Nirmohia Kara and Ramlala. Catch up on all the latest crime, national, international and hacky news here. Also download the new midday Android and iOS apps to get latest updates. This story has been sourced from a third-party syndicated feed, agencies. Except for the change in headline, the story has been provided, as is, as available, without any verification or editing from our side. Midday accepts no responsibility or liability for its dependability, trustworthiness, reliability and data of the text. Midday management slash midday.com reserves the sole right to alter, delete or remove without notice the content in its absolute discretion for any reason whatsoever.